Hey guys, hope everyone's doing good out there. So I just wanted to share with you, um, there's a few new recalls that just came out for the Hondas. Um, nothing major here, but I just wanted to share it with you if you haven't already heard it. Um, so don't be alarmed if you guys get a notice in the mail or something. So the first one affects a 2002 to 2006 Honda CRV. And that recall is due to some of those cars might have failing power window switches due to moisture getting in there. And they said what could happen is that actually start a fire. And there's been 23 reported fires already. So that's kind of a major one. So if you have those between a 2002, 2006 Honda CRV, definitely call Honda and see if your CRV is affected. Okay? The next one we have will affect a lot of us. It's the 2018 to 2020 Honda Accord and Hybrid. And the 2019 to 2020 Insight. Now, this one is a simple software update. Uh, the problem is they said the body control uh, module software can lead to uh, some malfunctions. So they were saying they can cause the windshield wipers not to work, the def defrosters not to work, rear view camera not to work, and some uh, exterior lights that won't turn on. And so this is a simple software update. Um, they said there's about 713,000 cars, Accords, that are affected. And now, Honda's going to start sending out notices January 18th. But if you want to get a jump on it, call your dealer. They'll ask for your VIN, and they can tell you if it's one of the affected ones. Because sometimes, like your Honda Link app and all that, it'll say you're not affected. But then really you are. So the best way, they say, is you call your dealer and they can let you know ahead of time. So you might want to do that. You know, if you wait till you get the notice, there might be a big influx of people going and it takes forever to even get an appointment. But it's a simple software update, so not a huge deal. So if you get that, don't worry, it's nothing major. It's just they have to reprogram it, okay? And it might have to do, some of you guys have been experiencing uh, warning lights coming on your dash. They said that could be a cause of it too. The soft, software is uh, malfunctioning. So that might be some good news, okay? Then the last one is involving a 2013 to 2015 Acura ILX and ILX Hybrid, 2012 Civic Hybrid, and 2007 and 2008 Fit. And I guess with these cars is it could be where road salts and contaminants can erode the drive shaft and cause it to break. So um, that's kind of major. And here is a list I'll put on the screen here. These are the states where the vehicles were sold or registered to. Okay, so look through that those states. If you're one of those states, definitely give your local dealer a call and see if you're one of the affected ones as well. So, guys, it's nothing major. I just wanted to share that. A lot of you guys probably know it, but if not, I hope this helps you guys out. Get a little jump on it instead of waiting a whole other month to get the notice in the mail. It's always nice to get a little jump on it too. So, so definitely, if you're one of the affected ones, just give your dealer a call and they'll let you know. And you can set up an appointment and get it fixed. So you don't have to worry about that. Okay, guys. So I hope that shed some light on it if you guys were concerned about it at all. Hope it helps some of you guys. Hope everyone's staying safe out there. Once again, I always appreciate all your guys' help, your feedback, and your support along the way. So I'll have another mod video coming out very shortly. So definitely stay tuned and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And I will catch you guys next time. Take care, everybody.